Good evening. evening. I'm Joshua Jeremy. And this is Dea Sanchez. Reporting for MEU News Patrol. A person product moment correlation coefficient, classification of distribution, and dispersion chi square test is one of the major reasons why statistics to be blamed for your low grades. Then we know who to be held responsible for making your life miserable. Joey, tell us more. Joey. Sorry for Alcohol who is taking this week show for another. This report is really about her. Miss her, are you the one responsible for a unwanted person for the moment for relation efficient, classification of the stupid card, and discretion she is fair test? Um, these are not unwanted things. These are all helpful things. As you can see, like the person product moment correlation coefficient, it is the first important effect size to be introduced in staff then classification of distributions. It's about the classifying probability distributions that forms the basis for a lot of modern statistical theory. In particular, the exponential family of distributions underlies the theory of generalized linear models. Then, the Pearson's chi-square test. It's a particular kind of chi-square test, a statistical test of significance. A man informed the stat community that no urgency in developing small sample sizes was a result from his keen trial and error. Who is he? Is he correct? Karen, tell us more about this report. Huh? What? Mr. Cassette did not make it right now, but he's on the phone. Mr. William Silly Cassette, are you there? You informed the statistics community that no urgency about developing sample A pleasant day statistics students. So what is this ANOVA and how can it help to our society? The concept of analysis of currents or ANOVA. This statistical procedure enabled experiments to answer several questions at once. The principal idea was to arrange an experiment as a set of partition sub-experiments that differ from each other in one or more of the factors or treatments applied in them. Well said! Problems of bias and multivariate analysis that we had solved in this plant-raising research are encountered in many other scientific fields as well. Hey. <laughs> yes? Uh, the experiments must be repeated in a number of control units of the material and that all units of material used in the experiment must be randomly selected samples from the whole population they are intended to represent. In this way, random selection is used to diminish the effects of variability in experimental materials. Well said students, I really had learned a lot from this interview. Madam, 
go. Madam, you know what? We're not failed to freak us out. Well, that's it for today. We hope that you had a good time. Learn new news. Love you. 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 And these are your anchors. Leanne Sanchez. And I'm Joshua Gervina. See you next week. Until the next episode of... Statistics News Patrol. What's happening? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? I mean, uh... uh sorry. Sorry. Ah. Uh.